Hello and welcome back to Transports Fever. Thank you very much for joining me in this video. Last time out, we did uh, we we upgraded our Chicago approach. So as you can see, we sorted out a few things on this side uh, to ensure that there's a bit bit more of a what's the right word for it? A bit more functionality, I suppose. Bit yeah, bit more functionality on. On the actual approach and we also looked at this side and realized that this is an absolute mess that's going to need um, fixing up pretty soon so we are going to be doing that pretty soon and also if we scoot right across the map right across the map we'll get to this side and we so sort of put uh, all the signals in over here and here uh, here there 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 so we've got here and there and yeah we, we sorted out all the signals going in and out and all around so that's what we did then I left it to you guys to see what uh, what sort of routes we wanted and the the response admittedly not not brilliant but there was a response that said that the the loop idea essentially stating that the loop idea is a pretty good idea but also they did mention getting something going to thunder bay so let's have a look at what currently goes into thunder bay just to get an idea and to make sure that i know what's what's going in so currently going into thunder bay let's do that we've got uh, the washington and chicago route so let's open them both up and have a look that's where they currently go. Sudbury, Toronto. Uh huh. Does it go to Detroit? It does. Detroit, Cleveland, then into Washington. So, what we could do is we could do another route to to Thunder Bay that takes into account Ottawa. So we can do a route that goes, uh, where from? We could get another one going out from Washington, I suppose. So we'll have one from Washington. Or, no, hold on, we've got one that goes from Washington. We could do one from Philadelphia. How busy is Philadelphia again? Still has two platforms free. So we could do one going from Philadelphia. No, I'm going to use the Philadelphia for the... Uh, okay, think, think, think. Come on, brain. Uh, no, yep, that, that will do. That will do. Okay, so we are going to use Philadelphia. So we're going to do a Philadelphia to Thunder Bay line first, passing through uh, Ottawa. Yep, so we'll do Philadelphia, Ottawa, um... Thunder Bay, just a nice, very fast, very fast line. So we'll do that and then we'll set up a second route. So we'll bring in two new routes. Uh, yep, and we'll start with this one, which is going to be, uh, what is it going to be? Philadelphia to Thunder Bay. That will do. And we are going to start with auto saves. That's about five minutes in. So there we go. We'll start at Philadelphia 30th Street. Move right the way up. We're going to pass through Ottawa. And then up to Thunder Bay. Then back down to... Ooh. Could we go a different way on the way back? Uh, no, no, we're going to go, we're going to stick on this route going two ways. Then back down to Ottawa and then back down to Philadelphia. Let's actually make that in a color that I can see, like that bright blue. All right, what do we have? All right, so I want to lock in that platform. So that platform is locked in, by the way, Apologies for a uh, uh, blocked nose and uh, yeah. Okay, that platform's locked in. Why is it suddenly? 
No, wh why did it do that? Alright, let me lock in the other platforms. Potentially. Let's have a look. Uh, um. Okay. So for Ottawa, perhaps I can use Platform 1. Ah, we can't use... Yes, we can. We can use Platform 1. We can use Platform 6. There we go. Uh, who is this red line? The Canada Circular. Uh-huh. How many of them are there? One, two, three, four, five of them. Five of them is not too bad. And how many on the St. Louis Ottawa? Also five. Uh, right. Right. So the question is, which track do I want for them? It doesn't really matter right now. Let's just leave it on, on four. Four for now. I'm assuming it's it will sort itself out uh, pretty quickly, which it does there, so everything's back on track. All right, being back on track, then from there, now this is where I just want to double check to ensure that that's going okay. So that then goes that way. Um, we're going to sort out the, the complete horrendous routing that is this setup I mean what is this we'll sort it out in a minute it'll go up to Thunder Bay and then we will let's see platform selection for Thunder Bay platform one Platform 1, Platform 2, which one do we want? Now we'll just use, we'll use, a, we'll use Platform 2. There we go, Platform 2 for Thunder Bay. That is fine. So now, who, which route does it run on? It runs along this route, which is... I suppose that's okay. How many are running on that route and that route? Okay, these are the faster trains. So maybe we should have it running on the inside route. Although, admittedly, it's not going to... Where does it become 4-track? Right, so for some bizarre reason it wants to run inside and outside so we're going to fix that by going inside there or oh, and in uh, no new uh, and inside there no inside there stations four and six are not connected well why I can't see any problems with that going that way. This is my complete confusion. Okay, let's work out exactly what's going on. Is it because of the way these split? No, the splits are fine. Back down to two track. All right, let's cancel that and figure out where it wants to go. No. Okay, let's run this through one track at a time. So, essentially, we want to leave out from this track. We will follow this along and then join up up here. Yes, to go around there. That's that's step one. Uh, I will get rid of these. Aha! Uh -huh. Why are you doing that? Okay, here we go. 
this is where things need to be placed correctly straight out of Philadelphia go that way there you go okay so now you're going to stay go up there around here uh, from from there it's around here and across there then you're okay going in all right that section of route is fine go through that that is fine go all the way along that around there and into the inside platform no 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 what why is this happening look how is that oh i see the issue this last platform was never connected there we go uh not like that That's what the issue was. Uh-huh. Okay. Good. So now, ideally, we'd want a signal right here. There you go. Okay. So now we go into platform one. Absolutely no problems. Then we go up this way. That's all fine all the way up aha uh -huh. so now we're staying on the inside all the way in and then it wants that outside line for some bizarre reason again i'm not too sure what's going on so i will go to this point and ensure that it does as a matter of fact stay on that side great then from thunder bay it should just go to this side and work now why does that not work is it something about not being able to get onto this line let's have a look is that the issue maybe that's the issue so back to the waypoints now maybe it'll work maybe it'll work now that's not the one i meant to press come on there we go yep that that was the problem okay and then it's going to stay on the inside and then do its you, no 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 that's wrong stay on the inside inside what's so hard about inside does that stop in Sudbury no it doesn't this one does though doesn't it yeah so it's got to stay on the inside how do I manage to keep it on that inside have I got any waypoints that will ensure that it stays on the inside no right okay so we've got to fix this little bit important uh, da -da 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 -da. where where do I fix this from suppose this point if I were to put a set of waypoints at this point here one two three four that's one two three four of those and then we can always add that that should keep it on the right side literally on the right track all the way in through Sudbury powering through the ghost town remaining on the inside all the way along all the way through I think that will do the trick nicely. Yep, I think that is going to do the trick.
pretty nicely. Now, am I going to get confused by any other trains going in and out? Yeah, I am. Is that one? Uh huh. That's no, not easy to see. That's okayish to see. Any anyone's now to get confused with? Uh, no, no, that's it. That's good. At least at this point, I'm assuming I'm going to get confused with other tracks. No, you know what? Bright and dull is okay. Yeah, that, that will do. I might have to change the colours of everything over eventually. Right, so that's that line done. Now comes the last, the last loop line. Now we'll probably have a clockwise and anti-clockwise of this. But uh, we'll see. So this one I want from Washington. We're going Washington. We're going to go Ottawa. Okay, now here is the question. Uh, okay, do we go? Do we go Toronto, or do we go up this way? Um. No, I feel we should go this way. Should we stop in Sault Ste. Marie? That's another big question. Let's leave it in for now. We're going to pass through Green Bay. We're going to pass through Milwaukee. And we're going to go straight into Chicago. And from Chicago, we're actually going to go down to St. Louis. At St. Louis, we're going to turn around. And every now and then, we'll go a little bit wayward towards... Uh, Columbus? Should we go back to Columbus or not? Or could we go to Cincinnati? Ooh, that's a, that's a big choice. I feel like we should probably go to Cincinnati. Skip Columbus, so everything stops in Columbus, doesn't it? Every platform... Aha! Uh -huh. Every platform in Columbus is used. Right, so we can't really skip Columbus. So we'll have to go to Columbus. Uh, forget Pittsburgh. And then I suppose back into Washington. Which should, it shouldn't be a problem. There we go. That looks good enough. So we're going to go PA Washington. Uh, no, no, no. PA um, Great Lakes. Which way are we going? Anti clockwise. Anti clockwise. PA Great Lakes anti clockwise. Is it anti-clockwise? Yes, it is. So I got a little bit confused there because I because of this crossover. I thought, wait, which way are we going? No, we are going definitely going anti-clockwise. And we should probably select. Wait, really? I thought you were on. Oh, well, that's all right. Yep, yeah, sure, I'll I can deal with that. So we'll lock in platform two. Let's go up to right. Okay, again, we need to make make sense of this. This one we've actually got an opening there, so we'll use it. So that's going to be Ottawa platform two. We can use. I, f I have a feeling Ottawa is going to become very busy and it's going to need more than the four platforms it has. Thankfully, we do have a way to... No, we don't. 
uh, I've made a I've made a hash of that. There isn't a way to expand to six platforms. Oops. Right, we'll just have to make do. Not to worry. Uh, past Sudbury through the middle. I hope yes. It is definitely through the middle. And then we've got these clear tracks. See these tracks? We're going to make sure that 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 clear track remains available to us. Okay, now this is where things get a little bit confusing. So I need to I need to ensure that each one of these are on the correct side. Now you see. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Hang on. Because of the nature of the bridge, these tracks are all a little bit wonky. In in this, uh, uh, hang on. And because of that, right? So the real side that this should be going on out of Susan Marie or into Susan Marie should be platform three. Oh, hang on. It's changed something else as well. Is that a good sign? Who did you change? What about you taking platform four then? You can see, look, look at that one there. That one there has got, has made a mess of everything. So how am I supposed to fix this? Unless I make that as a down that crosses over again. I'm going to have to rework this before we send trains out on it. That's going to have to be reworked. Uh, because that needs to swap over onto this side somehow. And then we should be okay. Uh, right. I will slip that for now. It's just so that moves on to that side. Clearing that up. And then we seem to be running okay. Now, at this point, what else could I do? I could have run it along there, but that's a little bit risky. And Green Bay is going to need to have all four platforms connected. So we're going to have to do that. I'm sorry, you're going to have to lose your house. Then it runs in fine towards Chicago. Again, Milwaukee is going to need to have all four platforms connected, which is going to require the rework over here, which I've been trying to do a rework on that section for a long time. So I suppose we have to do it now. And then hopefully this goes into the end. It does go to the end, which is perfect. That's exactly what I was hoping for. Yep, that's the platform I wanted, which is great. So I will lock in platform 12 right the way over to what trains are running on this. These aren't uh, Atlantics, are they? No, these are some nice, slow little trains. Oh, dear. Right. So for this we want right everything that's running into st louis as an active track um that's one that's one that's one i don't need that anymore there we go okay then it pulls into this track which is okay by me that's fine by me because it allows it to then go over this way which is correct this is probably going to need a rework maybe four track this section then it will run along there across here so from here it's going to go that way which is absolutely fine all uh, right it's going to pass through Cincinnati which this doesn't so maybe I'm going to need to add something that allows it to get onto this track. 
that would make it easier. Go through there, across, and then from, from here on out, it should be quite simple. Now, maybe get it onto platform two for Columbus. Oh, but hang on, these guys, these guys switch over. Now, what if I were to swap the platforms over for the ones that are going Oh, there's only one going straight. Ah, see, I could just bring that smoothly along and then that would help not get anyone stuck in the way there. That's something to consider. Okay. And then that runs along that outside, which is fine. All the way. I feel like we're going to have to run this on the inside, to be honest. But uh, that's okay for now. Then we get into the extremely, extremely busy section. Look at that. We've got uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 uh, tracks or lines going in and out spread across how many one two three four five six seven 13 lines spread across seven actual uh, routes and then we bring it in there and into that which seems to be okay so that looks okay so what I'm going to do now is just for the next few minutes. Let's see if we can get the anti-clockwise one sorted out. Uh, now the anti-clockwise one is going to be a problem. So we're going to go what? Washington to Columbus, Columbus to St. Louis, St. Louis to Chicago, Chicago to Saint Marie. Uh, yeah, let's let's try this one. Right. And we'll have you sort of in that color. So these are essentially the last routes, the last passenger routes that are going in now. There may be one more passenger route on that on that rail, but these are the last passenger routes going in. So we'll go Washington, Columbus. Um, St. Louis, Chicago, Sault Ste. Marie, Ottawa, and then back into Washington using the right route. That one worked pretty much immediately now. What about the track that it goes in on? I feel like it might be a good idea to have them all going in on the same track. No, that's probably a bad idea. Um... Hmm. We'll sort that out in a bit. What I'd like to do just for the next couple of minutes is just ensure that the platforms that it stops in are correct, which for this, I would rather it stopped in... That's Pittsburgh. That's not the one I wanted. I would rather it stops on the outside platform in Columbus. So that's platform six, please. Thank you. Which would be, I'm not sure what's going on there. Then going into St. Louis. Um, yeah, sure, why not? Just stop in the same platform. Uh, then, what is that route? Oh, that's a freight route. That's the uh, St. Louis coal, isn't it? comes along to this which is this is perfect so I'm going to lock Chicago into 11 I might try and open up 
these two because I feel like that might help. I think it might. I think I'm going to try and open up these two. These two to that root if possible. So that's going to need some more rework. And then Susan Marie for the last couple of minutes. Uh, Right, see, now this is where things get a little bit confusing. So for Sousa Marie, I actually want it to be on that route. But obviously the the Lake Michigan loop is causing issues. So we're going to have to redesign and sort that out. And then... Uh, boy. Yeah, you're all right there. You're all right there. Now, why would you do that? That's not logical. Now, is that because of the platform you've picked in Ottawa? I think it might be. Right. Right, right, right. What platform have you picked in Ottawa? That's not the right platform. On the way out, you're going to platform three three there you go done how how lovely so that should in theory uh, now stick on the right side as it splits it does but it doesn't stick in the middle which is where I thought it might uh. now I was kind of hoping you'd stay in the middle Sort of like Malcolm. No? Alright, well, we'll sort this out in the next video. So the next video is going to ensure that these are running and we're going to have to do a bit of work on um, correcting the root setups and stuff like that. However, I think I've got the perfect thumbnail for this. I think that could end up being the perfect thumbnail just to show the, the amount of tracks that are or the amount of routes that are running in and out of this section bring that right the way down as far as we can go thank you very much for watching please remember to hit the like button if you like this video subscribe to the channel for more videos on transports fever leave a comment in the comments box below letting me know what you think uh, don't forget to support me on patreon www.patreon.com slash ec gadget you will find the link to that in the description box below your support would be appreciated a massive massive amount and don't forget to follow me on twitch as well unless you're watching this on twitch in which case well yes yeah, so follow me um if not, if you're watching this on YouTube, www.twitch.tv slash ecgadget. I actually do streams now on occasion. I've uh, been doing a few test streams and stuff uh, the week preceding the day that this video has come out. So this video comes out on a Saturday that this week. I've been doing some test streams. So, yeah, make sure you, you do tune in for all of that stuff. Thank you very much once again for watching. And I will see you guys next time in Transport Fever Series 2, Season 2, Series 2. The Great Lakes.